Hello, my name is Kevin and welcome to Kevin Cuts Class. I'm in my hometown of Portland, Oregon. I've been looking online and um, I see that there are a lot of videos telling people what to do in Portland. And that's a great thing. However, it seems to me that there aren't quite enough videos uh, telling people what not to do in Portland because, you know, let's face it, knowing what not to do can be as valuable as knowing what to do. So I'm going to share with you a few places today that you uh, should really think about not going to when you are visiting Portland. Now, it's not that I have anything against these places in particular. They're perfectly fine places. You may well end up passing through these places en route to some other place. You may well visit the uh, businesses that, uh, if there are businesses, there are going to be businesses in some of these places that I'm going to share with you. So you may well visit the businesses, and that's, that's great. But what I'm saying is that as a tourist destination, you should think twice about these places. And if you come to Portland and go on a tour, and you see that the itinerary includes stops at these places I'm going to show you, then you should think twice about putting down your hard-earned money for a tour uh, with that company. All right, so um, let's go uh, take a look at some places to not visit as tourists in Portland. This is 82nd and Powell. You know, it's a perfectly fine intersection. Uh, it's quite popular, actually. You can see a lot of people come here, but not as a tourist destination. Strike this from your list of tourist destinations. This is 82nd and Powell in Southeast Poland. Okay, I think we've seen enough of 82nd and Powell. So, as we can see, there are businesses here that, you know, you may want to come to, like the KFC, for instance. That's good. Carl's Jr. right here. All right, that's good. Cabinet outlet. You can buy cabinets. And, um, all right, so, let's move on to our next no-go destination. Here we are at our next non-destination. This is Southeast 86th and Powell. We're still on Powell. You might think that I have uh, something against Powell. I actually have nothing against Powell. It's a perfectly fine street. And when I need to uh, take Powell to go somewhere, then, you know, it's great. It serves its purpose admirably. I would say, however, that as a tourist destination, 86th and Powell, you can do a lot. You can do a lot better than than this. Um, this is just my opinion, of course. Just my opinion. Um, I assume that you all know that, but I suppose I should say that. You may well come to Portland and decide that 86th and Powell is a fantastic destination for you and your family or whoever your traveling companions are. And um, I would love to see see your video on 86 and Powell as a tourist destination and see what you have to say about it. I will say that Powell has some really nice trees along the side as you can see here, which is great on a summer day. Gives you some shade. Oh, we'll give it that. Um, and these trees are even right here at 86 and Powell. So that's, you know, hooray for that. Uh, but okay, there you've got it. My two cents. Avoid 86 and Powell as a tourist destination and let's move on to our next non-destination. Here we are at our next non-tourist destination. I am on Southeast Stark, just a half a block from 122nd. This is another popular street. A lot of people come here, but they don't come here as tourists. They come here as motorists going somewhere else. As you can see, these people are all going to someplace not here. On the other hand, there are some businesses that you may choose to patronize. Nothing wrong with that at all, but as a tourist destination, I cannot stress highly enough that you should probably find some other place to go. There is this large abandoned parking lot here with a lot of no parking signs. I suppose you could let your kids out to toss the frisbee around if you really needed to. Uh, but again, there are a lot of parks in Portland that serve that purpose uh, even better than this stretch of, of asphalt right here. So 122nd and Stark, I would say, is a no-go for a uh, tourist destination. You can do a lot better. Let's move on to our next spot. Here we are at our next non-tourist destination. This is uh, 112th Street in Southeast Portland, 112th in Lincoln. You can see it's a residential area on a somewhat busy street. It looks like a perfectly fine place to live. However, as a tourist, 
there really isn't a whole lot going on here in 112 on Lincoln. And uh, you might want to reconsider coming here as a tourist destination if you're coming to Portland to do the tourist sorts of things. Coming to buy a house though, coming to buy a house, then you know, you could probably find something in the neighborhood that uh, might suit your needs. And that's a different story. That's a different video, different story. As a tourist, I would not come to 112th and Lincoln. Onward.